we'd like to welcome our General Minister and President, Reverend John Thomas, who will respond to some of the questions that have been submitted. Welcome, John. Thank you, Paul. Megan, thank you. And before we go to the questions, I have a word for Holy Trinity United Church of Christ in Hagerstown, Maryland, where I preached this morning for their 50th anniversary. Amen. I made it back safe. I'm in Cleveland, and no unpleasant experiences with the Pennsylvania State Police. <laughs> well, congratulations. Our first question, what exactly makes the UCC so different from our other partners in faith? We share a commitment to Jesus Christ, but we have found a way to reach out in an extravagant welcome. Not always fully successfully, but a broad welcome. And we've been a people ready to speak with evangelical courage at the moments when justice demands it. I think that's what makes us distinctive. Our next question asks, how are we designing our future to meet the challenges of the next 50 years? I hope that we're designing that future by listening to God, the still speaking God, and also listening to people all around the world, people who speak in other languages, but particularly people who speak in other faith traditions, asking us challenging questions and calling us into Ubuntu with them, into partnership, into Gemutlichkeit with people all over the world so that we can listen together to the still speaking God. And our final question. How do we build on this connection, the connection that we've built with this vibrant webcast? Well, Paul, I'm the last one to talk about how we build a connection with technology. But I hope with this kind of wonderful new experience, together with that good old-fashioned touch, we can find ways to build on the covenant that unites us together and celebrate all those connections that have been an important part of our life, right from that handshake that George photographed right to this moment on our webcast. <laughs>